After five years of development and another year of testing delays, Amazon's cashierless supermarket has finally opened for business. Located in the company's Seattle HQ building, Amazon Go relies on a sophisticated array of motion tracking cameras to create what it calls just walk out shopping. Amazon employees will scan their phones at a turnstile in the entryway, walk through the store, selecting whatever they please, including alcohol, and then simply walk out. The store's various sensors recognize what each person selects from the shelves and automatically debits their credit accounts. It's being hailed as the future of shopping, but like most cash-free setups comes with some racist and classist undertones, a high-tech convenience seemingly designed for the benefit of the wealthy and white. To start, the shopping experience demands that customers have access to both a smartphone and a checking account. Only 77% of Americans have smartphones, with blacks, Hispanics, and folks making less than 50,000 a year lagging well behind the national average. Then there's the fact that roughly 25% of African American and Latino households do not have access to checking accounts, compared to less than 5% of non-Hispanic whites. What's more, Slate Magazine has already confirmed that Amazon Go does not accept food stamps or other government subsidized grocery programs, so if you're a member of the working poor, well, you're SOL. Though this shouldn't prove to be too much of an impediment to Amazon's workforce, the store's initial test population, as nearly two-thirds of which consisted of white men in 2017. We'll see you tomorrow with more Engadget Today.